Hi everybody, it's Stephanie with Planning with Peanutty. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for joining me today. I have a haul from thehappyplanner.com. So let's just pop this open and see everything I got. Most of this was on clearance. I'll give you those prices in the description below if I can still find them. Um, only one item was full price. Everything else is clearance. So let's check it out. They throw in a little freebie emoji sticker for you there. A little happy face for the happy planner. Get it? Makes sense. Okay. So we have a bunch of sticker books, some paper. Let me just kind of shuffle these around and get sorted real quick. Some you'll recognize as being a little older, some things new to me, some things are repeats. So I bought this pad of paper. You get 24 sheets in here. This is from the Wrong Wrong Collaboration. And let me go ahead and pop this open. I bought this set to use with my planning for Go Wild next year. They have a leopard theme. So this has this pink foiled leopard print on the top of the front with all those wrong wrong ladies and then the back is just plain with the leopard print without the foil so I think that's that'll be good to plan out what I want to do during that conference all right so then I got this little sticker pad and this has a lot of fun summer seasonal stickers really cute all right and you can see we start off with some campfires and s'mores and some happy suns pineapples sunglasses bikes pizza burgers barbecue pineapple popsicles watermelon sunglasses beach balls sandcastles i could use a whole page of those sandcastles for beach days and then some of those really cute camper trailers and cars some fun summery words and then a whole page of movie night, which I find kind of interesting. I would use beach day way more often than movie night. And you can get movie night stickers and other sticker books. That's all right. And then some of these fun emojis and some bucket list kind of stickers down the center. So that's a lot of fun. And then I got this sticker pad. Careful using sharp objects when you're opening those. This is the Strong at Heart Disney Princess collaboration with the Happy Planner. And so we get a page there of Cinderella and Tiana and Belle. Jasmine, Rapunzel, Ariel, Aurora, and then we get them kind of a gold outlines, and that's it. So is that seven or eight princesses? So not all 12. Seven, it looks like. Yeah, seven princesses in there. Okay, then I can't resist the Christmas Joy sticker book. This is the mini one, so they're scaled down a little bit smaller. But I use those Christmas stickers a lot. I have an entire Christmas slash holiday planner. If you want to see some of those videos, I'll put links in the descriptions below. But I love these stickers, especially those cooking stickers, the gingerbread men. And I love all the Nutcracker stickers. And for what I paid for this sticker book, I would have gladly paid just for those few pages. So it was a bargain. Yeah, there's those Nutcracker stickers. I love it. And it's one of the only Happy Planner sticker books that has musical instruments in it. All right, love it. And then the Books Are Magic sticker book. This is a teacher sticker book, but you can see most of the sticker book is not specific to school but it's the same colors as the bookish sticker book. See, there's some spring break and fall break. Those are more aligned with school. And then the school subjects. But then you get a lot of colorful boxes. I just think it's really cute. The reading chairs with the cats and the bookstores and the girl with the books and her glasses. All the holidays. Some assignments, but you know, you could use assignment in due dates for other stuff, not just school. Notes and study. Very fun. All right, then a sticker book I did not have before is this Mickey and Friends, but this one's the colorful boxes. So this will coordinate with that other sticker book I bought to plan that week to Disneyland. You can see, look how cute this confetti, the tiny little mouse ears with the stars and dots. I just think that's adorable. But I have at least one more trip to Disney planned this year. And then I want to decorate for Disneyland's anniversary, which is also in July. So I thought having this sticker book would really help with all of that. 
You get the mini. I'm not crazy about the mini being black and pink because I'm sorry she wears red. She should be red and black. And then also the light blue from Mickey. Mickey does not have any light blue on him. Not crazy about the light blue. I prefer the red traditional Mickey. And then I have no idea what this page is doing in here. It's not a sticker page. It's just this sheet of plaid paper. I don't get it. Did yours come with a sheet of plaid paper in there? And I double checked and it's not missing any sticker pages. It's just really random. Let me know if you got a random sheet of plaid paper in yours. And then I love these pages. This is what for me it should be. All the red, gold, black, and blue. Those primary colors that all those Mickey and Friends use. Yeah, see Mickey's red, gold, and black. So I don't know what that blue is doing in there with him. And then I also wish this sticker book had a little more Donald in it. There's very little Donald in this one or the other one I already have. And he plays a bigger role in the cartoons than Mickey does, especially when is that, you know, after the first 10 years or so. Really cute. It's very fun. All right. And the last item I got is this little planner. Now, this is a 12 month planner. But it starts in July of this year, and it was actually clearance price by July. So check out their clearance section because not everything is old and expired. And it's just this gorgeous floral blooms spring looking planner. I absolutely love it. Now that things are moving away from being at home so much, I do teach some students in person. So I definitely need a tiny little mini planner that I can take with me in my bag. And it's set up just like all the regular planners. I'm just going to show you a quick flip through here. These gorgeous dividers with the florals and sentiments on them. This one is a dashboard view. And I like that it is colorful. And then let me just show you the dividers real quick. Again, it's a 12 month planner. Yeah, and you can see the color theme changes month to month. And again, it was on clearance, even though we're still in July. Like, it was not expired at all by the time I bought this planner. So always keep an eye on those sale and clearance sections in the stores. They're probably clearing this out so they could bring the student teacher planners in. And then they'll clear out those student teacher planners in the fall when they're bringing in the January start 12-month planners. So I'm excited about this one. It's really pretty. And check out my upcoming video of where I set it all up for my on-the-go mini. So make sure you subscribe to my channel so you don't miss that one. And I love how closely those pink discs coordinate with the floral. And that is my entire little haul. Oh, yes. And don't throw away this piece of plastic that comes wrapped around your planners. You can turn it into a little dashboard. So let me show you real quick with a pair of scissors. I just cut across the bottom, opening it up. And then let's curve that bottom edge and trim that part off. And I like curving all those corners because it is that thick piece of acetate. It could scrape your skin. So we want to round those corners. And then along the other side, round that corner. Cut across and then round that other corner. All right. And then you can discard the rest of that. And now you have this piece. You could use it as a dashboard. You could put sticky notes on it. You could decorate it, have a decorated dashboard in there. So do not throw away those pieces that you get. You could punch a hole in it and hang a dangly charm off the edge of your planner. So lots of uses for that. Don't throw that piece of hard plastic away. Yep, free dashboard. It's not as sturdy, obviously, as the ones you could get from the Happy Planner, but works quite nicely. And let's pull out everything we got again. We got that paper. They throw in that freebie sticker and some sticker books. And a couple of the sticker pads. We can call them sticker pads. All right, but let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Do you already have any of this? Uh, let me know. Do you want to check the prices? I'll put those in the descriptions below. But thanks everybody for watching. I love you and I'll see you next time. Bye.